mixed signals suggest sideways range to continue. Hello friends and welcome to today's new video series where we will provide an in-depth explanation of the market view for the month of March 2023. We will look at different time frames of the Nifty Index and also briefly discuss some key observations made on the USD INR weekly chart. We'll be uploading more videos into the series on a weekly basis going forward. So stay tuned to learn more. After a steady downtrend from 16th Feb to 24th Feb, last week was marked by high volatility with the Nifty Index experiencing wild swings. Nifty went down from 17,460 to 17,250 in two days and went up from 17,250 levels to 17,600 in the next three days. The question in every trader's mind right now is, now that the Adani problem is behind us, is the bottom done for now? And are we headed for high levels? Or is this another round of short-term bounds in the overall downtrending market? If you look at the multiple time frames of the Nifty Index, it clearly suggests we should take last week's rally with a pinch of salt and the odds of Nifty moving higher substantially from these levels are comparatively low. It may go up a little bit more, but it is expected to meet with some selling pressure again. Below is the monthly chart of Nifty. The price action on the monthly time frame chart suggests a sideways trading range. The fact that Nifty is still above the 20 EMA suggests the undertone is still bullish in the context of this sideways market. This is exactly the reason whenever Nifty falls, it meets with buying pressure at lower levels as the longer time frame charts are still holding their uptrend. A break and close below this 20-day EMA on monthly charts will aggravate the downtrend and only then we would see all hell break loose as far as the overall markets are concerned. If we drop down to the weekly time frame charts, we can clearly see Nifty exhibiting a sideways range again with the lower end of the range being 17,300 to 16,750 and the upper end of the range being 18,500 to 18,900. Currently, Nifty is trading at the lower end of the range around the support area. Now, if we look at the daily time frame range, Nifty is trading inside a downward sloping channel and currently attempting to move towards the upper end of the channel. Observe a small gap down around 17,772 to 17,800. This gap down, marked by the pencil lines, is likely to act as our first strong resistance in the week ahead. Markets are unlikely to move about these levels easily. Secondly, 17,800 to 17,900 area also has a confluence with the 50-day EMA. Let's also not forget that there is also the highest OI built up around the 17,900 18,000 back. Thus, with so many hurdles around a single level, the probability of markets breaching that level easily is very low. The rally in Nifty is set to continue maxing out for 200 points till it reaches the 17,800 levels, post which it is likely to meet with selling pressure again. On the downside, 16,700 to 16,800 area will continue to act as a strong support. Let's take a look at the Nifty Daily chart. A break of this range on either side is likely to give a directional bias for the markets and make us change our view. Let's also examine some interesting observations on the USD INR chart. Let's take a look at the USD INR weekly chart. USD INR and Nifty are exactly inversely correlated. Here, the USD INR chart is also trading in a rectangular range of 83.30 to 80.50. A break on either side of the range on the chart will trigger a potential break in Nifty as well. Thank you for watching today's video. If you like today's video, don't forget to like and share the video with your friends and family. Make sure to click on the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get an instant notification when we upload new videos in the future. We'll see you again next week with a fresh update on the overall markets and key levels to watch out for.